Hello, YouTube. I'm going to do something that's probably stupid, but I'm going to try to run MC map. I think it is. I think that's the one I picked. And run fraps at the same time. I hope it works. But first, I really want to make a save of my folder here. Now, what's going on? Or first thing I to get is a date. That's funny, huh? I have to go to the bottom to see today's date. That's how on top of the world I am. Top of the world! Alright, so 7-zip completes a lot of little files in Minecraft. Uh, for those of you that, the few of you that don't know yet, I have to find MC Map again. Oh, great. Um, let's show you. Your users, and that's my username. Apta, this is hidden. You have to tools, folder options. This is Windows Vista, 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 whatever. Um, show hidden files and folders and apply that so you can even see this app data section. Roaming, Minecraft, and saves right there. All right, let's get to what we were really doing. This. Oh man. Memory limit and everything, and I'm running fraps. Oh, here we go. Blow up. It'd be 10 times slower than normally would. You know, it would actually be 10 times smarter for me to load this first, like turn off fraps and then turn it back on, but I'm just not that smart. Alright. So, let's find iRizon's Ice World. It said North was in the bottom. But that means nothing to me. Mm -hmm -hmm. Where could this be? This has to be. Yeah. Yeah, right here. Right around here-ish. How much can you zoom in? Enough to make it look terrible. Uh, this is, I think, where I come out for the nether. And go along and do to do to do. There's the biome that I go across, and there's my little furnace, I believe. And this would be the place that I set up that cliffside entrance. And then over here would be. All right, I'm just making stuff up now. That's quite obvious. All right, let's go look at what we made up uh, uh, here. Uh. Hey, look at that! I on ice world. Excellent. That is really cool. There's my spawn shrine. There's my house. Oh, there's my uh, minecart track. Going all squirrely through the mountains. Hey, squirrely. And then goes down under here. And then we can see. Come up here and there's my portal. Right, so I, I'd like to play with MC Maps other options without having you suffer through it. And see if I can get a little higher clarity. I'm going to try to find, I really do think that this is where I come out. Do 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 do. Yeah, because this was all this ugliness. It's on the beach. There was some clay here. It looks like there's still some there. If even if that is clay, it'd be dirt. Right. So the, normally the way I take is I come out. I wish I could see the torches. Oh, you know what? I think it's right down there behind that mountain because I'd have to hop over here. All right. So I come out. I go up this way. I'm like in the water. Oh no, things are all around me. Oh man, oh, go up here. And then the, ne the next, I'm like facing that way, and the next me Mega Man music starts, and I can't talk, and I'm like, oh, psh, and I go down here. And then I'm like, oh man, I make a bunch of sound effects, explosions, cars. Oh, look at that! There's my little, uh, I don't know what you call that thing, a stupid lodge. Yeah, dude, that's stupid. All right, and then I go, who knows where? I like turn around and stuff. <laughs> it's got to be some place over here that I can't see, because I would think that waterfall is coming down. Yes, yeah, right. You don't know where the L you are. Well, hey, how's this, guys? Huh? A low res, uh, actually pretty high res PNG, but. All the way zoomed in. Isn't that interesting? Alright, I'm going to play around with this. I will be right back. If you're not already bored of tears by now, you will be. Alright, so this is MC map that I've been using. You saw me use once. 
It can render terrain unlit in day mode with shadows. Night mode underground with show caves. I'd like to see caves. That would be awesome to see how much I have. This is a nighttime. And again. What are you doing? Or right, whatever. This I don't have to worry about writing to anything. Whoa. We are zoomed in as all hell. Give me the full screen, buddy. Nighttime, no one can see shiznit. Is something on fire over there? Because I did not light anything on fire over there. Mm -hmm. Alright, I was right. This is where I come out. Oh, I placed a test pumpkin there when I was testing. Looks like a portal? Or is that just water? Pretty purple, but yeah, it's just water. That's cool. Well, you can see under the ground the lava will light up. Alright, we are looking for bright lights. One bright light. That's where my furnaces are. And I'm afraid that the other place I went to is nowhere near with the direction I'm looking at. Or in effect it's just so poorly lit up or it's facing completely a nope, that's it right there. Huh. So I went like this. That's kinda sad. Because I could have went like this. Oh well, that's fine. That's cool. So I, all I need to know is I, if I follow my spawn compass. Spawn compass. Getting worse and worse. On my beaster, <laughs> I would come on around here. Which is, it kind of looks far, but I doubt that's actually very far. I am not trying Minecraft right now because the beta has a few problems with it. If you read not just Twitter and blogs and all that stuff. But yeah, all the rest is, is completely unexplored terrain. And uh, some of the code gen looks to be a little bit screwy right now. That is a cool looking valley. I have not been over there yet. And this as well, he's stuck into some crazy formations. And is that dirt? That better be. Alright. Try another view. All right, and that sucker's done. Let's try it now. Yes, I am saving all these in different areas and calling them different names, so I can pour over them later like a scientist. All right, these are the current caves I've explored. Nothing too fancy. Hope I'm going somewhere with this. Yeah, there we go. Very interesting. It registers my spawn point as a cave which I haven't been able to correct that's inside my house that looks like my garden this has got to be a toaster trap and that's a uh, spawn point all the little torches are everywhere right and that's a staircase under my house There's a lot of lava down there. A lot, a lot of lava. As we go, or oh, yeah, that has to be the place I built. All right, so this is actually a better way, almost, to see what you've explored because that's the waterfall house that I made. This is where my portal comes out. I dug that super long, huh? Damn. I, I did just dig a long... I, I don't know. I didn't know what direction I was going. I, I don't know what I was doing. I don't know what I'm doing right now. Alright, now I can see a much better... A few better angles. This happens to be... It's got to be the... Um, Bridge through the lava, right? It goes in here, and my base is covered the 
hell up. Right. Right, 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 right. Should be a set of stairs going up here, but... Oh god, it's so hard to tell. Ooh. What have we here? Yeah, it's a really hard time telling whether this is stone or what it is. Especially when you want to zoom right in like this, and there's no large structures to take up the area. This is much easier doing with something like this. Minecraft X-Ray. This is a maintenance branch. Uh, buddy, I gotta give you your name. By Z <laughs> him. Zolotolo. Z Z so, thank you, Zolotolo. Um, ah. Minecraft forums, you buggy piece of crap. I'm sure all your ads are getting in the way of my, <laughs> my <laughs> surfing. I know you need ads, don't mind me, I'm just a dickhead. Alright. So the old version is by plus minus. Well, that's easy to remember. It's not Zolo. So I'm gonna get this. Look at this, he's got a plethora of download sites on multi-upload. And so we'll go with the guy who's already giving me ads instead of going to everyone else who's going to give me ads. MindViewer, I believe, has also been updated fairly recently. It's on GitHub, too. That's what I like to see. We have, it looks like, very basic representations of... Huh? It's snowing in hell. What's going on here? Right. So yeah, it's snowing in hell on this weird animated GIF. Freaky dude. Anyway. Oh, I got MC Edit too. That's also a good one to use to show everything. With MC Edit? Alright, I'll actually show you this one I'm trying to do. Check this out. Alright, let's load World 1. It's gonna be cranky too, because I'm craps in it. Oh, that's right. Oh, God, I'm somewhere in, in hell. Not in hell, but you know what I mean. I'm at my, my drunken spot. Graphical oddity. Doesn't matter. Okay. My spawn point used to be move for me. Right here. Oh, this thing is really hard to operate. It used to be right here. It used to be right on top of this block. And I left it open. The only thing I really changed was added more blocks on top to the spawn point. Or whatever this thing is. The spawn shrine. Which may have somehow affected it, but I know it pretty much happened the first time I ever went to the nether. And my spawn part, my spawn point has been moving like all around in this area. Sometimes I'll pop over here, sometimes I'll pop where it is right now. Yeah, up there. Which is high enough down that I actually lose two or three hearts on the way down. Although this time it might be above water. And every time you do something like this. Which by the way, I do not like this tool. Alright, right, it's not even, I don't even know how to move it, how to save it there, but, control S to save. Now, part of the reason, too, I might be screwing up the code somehow by not having anything under here. I could fill this up to the top with sand, and hopefully that will alleviate that and go back to the way it used to be. So you should spawn right on top of it. I mean, there was no alters, no edits, I didn't try to make myself spawn there, that's just where I started out and made a spawn around it. Alright, whatever. Let's control save this. Right, and get the hell out of here.
perhaps it'd be easier too to turn fraps off for desktop mode and then turn it back on. Like, there's no reason that Minecraft X-Ray didn't work this time. It it should work, but whatever. All right, so here we have. I stood off really high in the air too. I think. Right. Pink must represent the glass there. Or something. That's a little spot I made. It's going to be really hard to tell what anything is with this. Did I just fuck up the chunks with the... Uh, excuse me for swearing. Did I just mess up the chunks with that Minecraft x-ray? I could know what I hope not. That's alright. That's why I save. And back up my save. Of course, I went into this without reading the readme or anything. Oh, you know what? Do I actually have to load? Right. Right, that's how this one works. Well, that's not very interesting. Whoa! But that is really cool being able to see a side slice. Although it, it's not rendered the best. Maybe there's some options I can mess with. But that's really cool seeing it like this. I'm not sure what all the colors represent. It's obviously very basic and dumb. To, oh, look, some diamond. Yay, wherever that is. And a piece of water. Ugh, right there. Whoa. Not just a piece. Wow, and you get a sense of the uh, underground caves here. We have struck gold. This is another completely cave-rich area. Wow, this is going to be great. Once I start exploring all these... Yeah, alright. Uh, Beta, I hope you get... What the hell? You get fixed soon. And this must be a dungeon. That's got to be a spawner and two chests. And that's going to be mossy cobblestone. Yes. Perfect. Perfecto. And there's my oh wow. And there's my new house and like the spawners like down there somewhere. That's amazing. That's like right near the freaking What? Two of them. Uh, not as close as my old double dungeons, but it might just be time. Mmm. That is freaking beautiful. Trap away. Yes, I know I'm cheating. But I hope you learned something uh, by the use of these mobs. Mod is, uh, I'm sorry for the, I really am sorry for the rambling and stuff. I just, I'm not a pro. I just kind of do this for fun. And um, this is great, man. I am so excited about these two spawners. All right, later.